It's time for high school basketball game night. Now here's your play-by-play -play announcers for tonight's game. Hello and welcome to the campus of Northview High School for a big matchup between the Northview Cougars and the Andalusia Bulldogs. Hi, I'm Mick Kirkland bringing you all the action tonight from Cougar Gyms. And the tip goes to the Cougars and it goes over to Zach Kelly. And I believe he stepped on the line, so it's going to be out of bounds on the Cougars. Taking it out for Andalusia's number 43, Curry. He passes it in to D.L. Smith. Smith tries to get it in, and he gets it in to number 55, who puts it up and gets his own rebound, but he couldn't hold on to it, so it's going to be the Cougars ball. Zach Kelly sets it up for the Cougars. He tries to get it into Gibson. Gibson gets it back to Kelly. Kelly over to uh, number 14, and uh, it's blocked. That was Brandon Morrison's shot blocked. So it's going to be the Bulldogs ball. In case you didn't know, uh, Andalusia is the home of uh, Robert Ory, professional basketball player. He played with the Bulldogs many, many years ago. Feed into number 55, Johnson for two. Helms with it for the Cougars. He pulls up, shoots, count it. Cedric Helms for two. Smith brings it down for the Bulldogs. The Cougars have been led this year by number one, Xavier Gibson, who has already signed a scholarship to play uh, major college basketball with the Florida State Seminoles down the road in Tallahassee. And it's going to be a kick ball, so the ball will remain with Andalusia. Taking it out is Curry. He inbounds it to Smith. Smith over in the corner to Curry. Shot 4-2. That's number 11, James. And then Andalusia comes up with the steal on the inbound pass for Northview. Gibson gets the rebound, but it's stripped away by Denson. They get it over to number 55, and Gibson goes up high over the rim for the rebound. Zach Kelly takes it up and in. Good drive to the basket that time by Zach Kelly. And he was fouled. Foul called on number 42. 43, Carey, his first. Zach Kelly makes it a three-point play. So it's a Northview lead, five to four. The Enterprise, Kelly knocks it out of bounds. So it's still going to be the Bulldogs ball. The inbound the ball to D.L. Smith. And the Cougars steal the ball. Nice feed and a reverse layup by Joe Coachman. Nice feed that time from Xavier Gibson. Cougars, a lot of pressure, and it looked like we may get a 10-second call, but they do get it across the line. It's put up by number 11, James, for two. Four points for James. Cougars leading 7-6, 4.50 left in the first period. 
They try to get the ball into Gibson. It's taken away by uh, Curry. And he loses it out of bounds. So it's going to be the Cougars ball. Hems takes it out for the Cougars, inbounds it to Zach Kelly. Kelly brings it across midcourt over to Coachman. And he tries to get it into Gibson. And it's off the hands of a Andalusia player. Hems takes it out. Gets it in to Gibson. He puts it up. Xavier Gibson for two. So Northview's up nine to six. Four seventeen left in the opening period. Andalus is just working the ball around the perimeter. Shot from behind the three-point line. It's missed. Rebounded by Gibson. Out to Kelly. Kelly gets it across midcourt and feeds it down to uh, Morrison. Foul is called on Morrison. His first, the team's first. Substitution into the game is number 32, Enrico Biggins. Morrison goes out. That time, they, Gibson knocks it out of there. Number 55, Johnson thought he could put it up, but Gibson was there waiting on him. To swat it back. Shot up, missed. Gibson gets the rebound, but it's taken away by his teammate, Coachman. Over to Enrico Biggins. Biggins spins. He puts it up and misses, and he's fouled on the play. Foul called on number 43, Curry. That's going to be his second foul. So at the line shooting two is Enrico Biggins. Biggins misses the first. Second shot up, and it's good. North, you're up by four, 10 to six, 303 left in the first period. Shot put up by Johnson is no good. Gibson slams it through. Nice feed that time from Zach Kelly to Gibson on the fast break for the slam. North York by six, 12 to six. They get the ball over to Curry. Wide open shot from number 31 and it's missed and rebound goes to Joe Coachman. He gives it to Gibson. Zach Kelly sets it up. They try to get it into Gibson, and it goes out of bounds. So we're going to take a break with 148 left in the first. The score of Northview 12, Andalusia 6. Okay, we're back. They get the ball to Zach Kelly. Oh, he tries to get it into Gibson. He wasn't paying attention. And Andalusia gets the ball, and that's number five, D.L. Smith, with the basket. That time they tried to get the ball to Gibson, and he wasn't looking for it. 
and it's taken away by a carry of Andalusia. So two straight turnovers by the Cougars. Wide open shot from number 11, missed, and uh, rebound. Biggums comes up with the rebound, and he throws it away. So let's take a break with 108 left in the first. The score is 12 for Northview, 8 for Andalusia. Okay, we're back in action. Just over a minute left in the first period. Northview up by four, 12 to eight. And the losers made a couple of baskets off of turnovers by Northview. And that shot by number 43, Curry, is good. So it's a 12-10 game, Northview leading Andalusia. Kelly dishes off to Gibson. Gibson goes up and is blocked, but they got him with the body. That was number 55, Johnson. It's going to be called for the foul. His first. It's going to be the team's third. At the line is Xavier Gibson. He has two points in the game. A slam on a fast break. Gibson's first free throw up, and it's good. Second shot up, and it's good. So Gibson makes both of his free throws. Northview up on top by four points, 14 to 10. And Andalusia throws it away. And Helms takes it in for two. And the foul. Foul called on number 31, Denson, his first, the team's fourth. Helms at the line. He puts it up and he completes a three point play. So five points in the game for Helms. 14 seconds left in the first period. Northview's leading by seven. Andalusia's having a little trouble handling the ball, and the clock is going to run out on them, and it did. So at the end of one, the score is Northview 17, Andalusia 10. We'll be back after this commercial break. Okay, we're back at the beginning of the second period of play. We're live on the campus of Northview High School where the Cougars are taking on the Andalusia Bulldogs. Hi, I'm Mick Kirkland, and I'll be, and I'm bringing you all of the action, and we saw a lot of action in the first period. Northview's pretty much been in control most of the game, but Andalusia showed some sparks of, uh, of energy here in the game. Smith passes it over to Carey. And one thing Northview's going to have to do to win this game, they they need to get number one Gibson involved in the game. And that time, uh, number 55, Johnson, was going to try to lay the ball up, and he saw Gibson standing there, and those hands stretched out, arms stretched out. He had nowhere to go, so they call him for traveling. Ball goes over to Joe Coachman. Coachman hits Zach Kelly on the run, and Kelly goes out of bounds, so it's going to be Andalusia's ball. They're trailing by 7, 17 to 10. Smith brings it down for Andalusia. Over to Curry. 
Curry over in the corner to Denson. Shot up, missed, rebound, and Xavier Gibson goes up with the left hand and swats it out of there. Over to Gibson, but behind the three-point line. It's short, but Kelly's there for the rebound. Puts it up, misses, but there's Zyka, there's Coachman with the rebound. Puts it up and in. Joe Coachman for two. Four points in the game for Coachman. Cougars up by nine, their biggest lead of the game, 19 to 10. Shot pulled up short by Smith. Rebound to Coachman. Coachman gets it over to Kelly. Coachman from behind the three-point line. Count it. Joe Coachman, five points in a row for Coachman. And Andalusia wants to call a timeout and talk about it. So with 548 left in the second period, the score is Northview 22, Andalusia 10. I can plug this thing back. Remind me at halftime to plug this back in, Don. <clears throat> okay, we are back in action. The Northview Cougars leading by 12 points, 22 to 10. And Andalusia comes out of a timeout and turns the ball right back over to the Cougars. Cougars inbound the ball to... Zach Kelly. He gets it to Coachman. They get it back to Coachman. He pulls up. It's short. Rebound goes to James. And it's Andalusia's ball. Smith brings it across. He gets to the curry in the corner. Smith shoots for a three, and it's good. D.L. Smith for a three, five points in the game for Smith. So it's a 22 to 13 game. Northview's leading Andalusia. Over to Helms in the corner. Count it, it's a three. Zarek Helms. Eight points for Helms in the game, unofficially. Curry goes in to change for two, six points for James. 25-15, Northview up by 10. They've led by as many as 12. Bigham drives and lays it up, a reverse layup. He misses, and the rebound goes to... Andalusia. They try to get the ball in that time. Smith tried to get it in low to Johnson. And they say it's going to be off of Northview. So taking it out is Curry for Andalusia. Have a substitution in the game is uh, number 20, Gibson. And that one was good by uh, Johnson. So it's down to a eight-point lead. Bigham goes up. And Rico Bigham. Foul called on number 11, James. Enrico Biggums, one of two from the line for one point. 
make it one of three. Second shot up, missed, but Gibson gets the rebound, puts it up, and it rolls in. Big play by Gibson. North you back on top by 10, 27 to 17. It's kicked by Joe Coachman. 325 left in the first half. And the losers just passing the ball around, hoping to break down the defense. They almost lose it out of bounds. Denson with it. Back to Curry, to King. And down under, nice feed down to Johnson for two. That time they left Johnson wide open. So it's a 27 to 19 game. They get it in to Xavier Gibson. He puts it up. It's short, and it's knocked out of bounds off of Zach Kelly. So it's going to be Andalusia's ball. Denson gets to Smith. Gibson blocks it. Curry tried to challenge him, but Gibson was waiting on it. Bigham lays it up and in for two. Northy back on top by 10, 29 to 19. Minute 57 left in the first half. And they throw it away. So we're going to take a timeout here with 152 left in the second period to score. Northy 29 and to lose to 19. Okay, we're back. Northview inbounds the ball. Kelly brings it across the timeline. Gibson gets it, tries to get it into Gibson. It's a little too high. And we're going to have a foul called on number 20. It will be his first. It's a non-shooting foul. Neither team in the bonus. 135 left in the first half. Curry gets it in to Denson. And that time, Johnson gets it up over Gibson for two. Eight points for Johnson. It's an eight-point Northview lead. Get it to Biggums. Biggums out to Gibson. Zach Kelly looks around. Get it to Joe Coachman from the corner for three. Coachman for another three. Coachman's second three of the game. Ten points for Coachman. We're under a minute left in the first half. Northview up by 11 points. Kerry gets it. Kicks it back out to Smith. Shot missed, but the rebound was number 11. And rebound goes to Zach Kelly, and he gets it out on the fast break to Biggums for two. Northview up by that biggest lead of the game, 13 points, 34 to 21. At the line is number 55, Johnson, who has eight points. 
make it nine. So we're back to a 12-point game. Johnson gets the roll, so it's a 10-point game. Gibson takes it in and it lays it up for two. So at halftime, the score is Northview 36, Andalusia 23. We'll be back with second half action after this timeout. Northview High School, where the Cougars are taking on the visiting Andalusia Bulldogs. And so far, it's been all Cougars. That foul is called on number 32, Enrico Biggins. That'll be his first, the team's first. Uh, kind of recapping the scoring in the first half. Uh, Northview scoring was led by Joe Coachman with 10 points. He had a couple of three-pointers. Zarek Hems had uh, 10 points, had eight points, and uh, Gibson had six points. Biggums had five. So Johnson hits one of two. So it's a 12-point game. 24 for Andalusia, 36 for Northview. Leading score for Andalusia, number 55, Johnson had 10 first half points, followed by number 11, James, with uh, six points, and uh, Smith had five. Zach Kelly with two. That brings his point total up to five points, 38-24 for the Cougars. And they force a turnover that time, and it goes right into hands of Biggums. He gets it over to Kelly. And Kelly tries to get it over to Coachman, and they lose it. Helms almost comes up with the steal there. The little man goes in over the big man. Out on the fast break. Helms puts it up. Misses. Biggums comes up with the rebound. And he looked like he was going to pass it over to Gibson, but he put it up and in. And Rico Biggums, seven points. Biggest lead of the game, 16 points for the Cougars. They're up 40 to 24. And we're going to have an offensive foul called on James. So it's going to be the Cougars ball. Zach Kelly with the ball for the Cougars. He brings it across midcourt. Over to Coachman. Coachman drives toward the basket. He loses it to Johnson. Johnson goes up, and he puts it in. 13 points for number 55, Johnson. Foul called on Zach Kelly, his first. Team second. Johnson puts it up, and it rolls in. So it's a... 13-point lead for the Cougars, 40 to 27. Opening couple of minutes of the third period. Kelly gets it into Biggums, who goes up and he misses, and Gibson tries to slam it back, and he slammed it a little too hard, and it came out. But we have a foul on the play. Foul call on number five. Helms takes it out. And he throws it right into the hands of Smith. Carry with it. Gets it back over to Smith. Smith gets it in to Johnson, who puts it up and in. Northview's got to get a little more aggressive defensively. 
They can't allow uh, Johnson to just put them in like that. And we're going to have a foul called. Call on number 55, Johnson. So it's going to be the Cougars ball. They'll take it out under the basket. Zarek Hems takes it out. Zedrick Hems takes it out for the Cougars. He gets it in to Coachman. Hems from behind the three-point line. He was wide open. But missed, and it's going to be off of Zach Kelly's hand, and it's going to be out of bounds on the Cougars. Andalusia has outscored the Cougars 6-4 to four here in the opening minutes of the third period. Gibson with the rebound, and it's taken away by Smith. He gets it into Johnson to carry, but then Gibson comes out of nowhere and blocks it. And then they turn it over to Curry, but Coachman blocks it. Johnson gets it. He puts it up. Missed. Missed. Curry gets it up for the third time, and it's good. Missed by Gibson. And the rebound goes to Jones, to James, excuse me. Right now, Andalusia's come out this third period. They're playing a lot more aggressive. Gibson gets the rebound. Gives it to Zach Kelly. The Cougars have gone cold here in the second half. They've only scored four points. Gibson goes up, and we're going to have a foul called uh, number 55, Johnson, and I believe that's going to be his third foul. Andalusia can't afford to let Johnson get in foul trouble. He's their leading scorer with 16 points. Gibson's at the line. He's... Two of two from the line tonight. Make it three of three for a total of seven points. Second one up, and it's good. So eight points for Gibsons, and the Cougars back on top by 11, 42 to 31. Smith brings it down for Andalusia. Gets it over to Curry. Kicks it back to Smith. Smith puts it up. Miss. Gibson gets the rebound. And he gets it out to a Coachman. Coachman over to Zach Kelly, who gets it across the midcourt line. Kicks it over to Helms. To Coachman. So the Cougars slow it down and set it up. Coachman fades away. Misses. Johnson gets the rebound over to Smith. Smith tries to get it into James. Three second call. So we're going to take a timeout with 2.53 left in the period. The score 42 for Northview, 31 for Andalusia. Okay, we're back. Northview on top by 11. 42 to 31. Hems takes it, puts it up, misses. Rebound goes to Denson. And he tries to put it behind his back. He almost loses it, but he maintains control. Curry puts it up. Missed. Gibson rebounds it. Gets it to Hems. Kelly gets it. Puts it up and in. Zach Kelly for two. Seven points for Kelly. Four in the second half. He had three in the first half. Coachman, that was like an interception, and he tries to get it over to Bigham, and it goes out of bounds. So it's going to be 
And a loser's ball with 153 left in the third period. D.L. Smith with the ball for the Bulldogs. Nice feed, but a great block by Xavier Gibson. That time, James broke toward the basket. He thought he had an easy layup, but Gibson was there waiting, and he blocked it. So we're going to take a timeout with 139 left in the third to score. Northview 44 and the loser 31. We'll be back after this break. Okay, we're back in action. And Gibson almost steals the ball. And kicking the ball, it's going to be Northview's ball there. Up by 13, minute 31 left in the period. Northview's been up by as many as 14 points. They took a 40 to 24 lead with 6.30 left in the third. They get it into Biggums, and he loses it. And Smith on the fast break. And that time, they call a tech on, I believe it's going to be called on Coachman. Yeah, it's going to be called on Coachman for hitting the backboard. So, James is going to be at the line shooting. That was a bad shot and a bad decision by Coachman. So James puts up his first technical shot. It's good. Second shot. Up. Count it. So eight points for James. It's a 12-point game. 44 to 32. Put back by James for two. That's ten points for James. It's a nine-point game. 44 to 35, under a minute left in the period. Helms kicks it out to Zach Kelly, who puts it up. Miss, but Bigham's there for the rebound. Puts it up, but put it back. It's number one, Xavier Gibson for the slam. 46, 35, 32 seconds left in the third. Traveling call on that. Whoa! <laughs> he took three steps before, <laughs> before he dribbled the ball. <laughs> they called a foul on, on Northview. I, I didn't get the player's number who they called a foul on, but he, he took about three steps before. He put the ball on the floor. Zach Kelly gets the rebound on a miss. He goes down, and he's going to be fouled by number 11, James. 13.2 seconds left in the third period. Northview up by 11. At the line is Zach Kelly. He's one of one from the line tonight. Make it two of two. Eight points in the game. So Kelly makes both of them. So Kelly's perfect from the line. He's three of three from the line. And Northview's on top by 13. 35 to 48. At the end of one, the score was 17 to, to 10. Northview took a 36 to 23 lead into halftime. And now they're leading by uh, 
13, and the ball is stolen by Hems. He goes up. Oh, and it almost rolls in, but rolls out. Foul called against number 43. That's Curry. So Zedrick Hems is at the line. We'll see if it's a shooting foul. I think it, I think it, I think it may be a, a non-shooting foul. The officials are discussing it. Eight point four seconds left in the third period. No, he missed the shot. So the officials are, are talking. He was in the act of shooting, but the ball didn't go in. The ball. So, so there's still some discussion going on. Okay. It was it was no basket. No basket. So. He's going to be shooting, too. He was in the act of shooting. So at the line is Zedrick Helms. Helms has eight points in the game, all coming in the first half. It's up and good. So Northview back on top by 14, matching that biggest lead of the game. Hems makes the second one. So Northview goes up 50 to 35. And the ball is stolen by Hems. So we're at the end of three. And the score is Northview 50 and Andalusia 35. We'll be back with the fourth and final quarter of action after this timeout. Come to campus of Northview High School where the Northview Cougars are hosting the Andalusia Bulldogs, and they are leading by their biggest lead of the game, 15 points by a score of 50 to 35. Bigham takes it to the basket for two. And Rico Bigham's nine points. Biggest lead of the game, they're up by 17. And that time, Coachman just takes it away from Johnson. Foul called on number 31, Denson. At the line is Zach Kelly, who's perfect from the line tonight. He's uh, three of three. Make it four of four. Ten points for Kelly in the game. Kelly, perfect from the line, five of five. So it's a 19-point lead. Andalusia had cut the lead down to nine, but Northview has pointed on here in the last few minutes. Gibson, shot over Gibson is Johnson for two more. Zach Kelly gets it across. He gets it to Gibson. 
Gibson fakes it, and it's knocked out of bounds. It's the Cougars ball. Coachman takes it out, inbounds it to Kelly. Kelly kicks it over to Bigham, back out to Coachman. He hits Kelly down the middle of the lane for two. Nice feed that time from Joe Coachman to Zach Kelly. Johnson is really strong. He keeps taking it to him. Bigham puts it up. Off you up, 56 to 39, and they're going to go to Johnson every time. And Jepson's going to say, hey, I'm going to reject you this time. You can't just keep coming in here on me and think you're going to get away with it. You're going to have to work for it. 6.02 left. Shot up, miss. And it's going to be off Gibson's foot. So it's going to be Andalusia's ball. Taking it out is uh, James for Andalusia. He gets it into Smith. Over to Curry, breaking down the baseline for two. Six points for Curry. Nice feed to Zach Kelly. And we're going to have a, a goaltending. Count it for Zach Kelly. 58 to 41. Northview leading 535 left in the fourth period. Ball goes into Johnson for two. 12 points for Johnson. It's a 15 point lead. Ball goes to Bigham. He goes up with the reverse layup for two. And Rico Bigham's. 11 points for Bigham's. So we're going to take a timeout on the court with 4.53 left. The score is Northview 60. Andalusia, 43. Okay, we're back at the line for Andalusia. It's number five, D.J. Smith. His first time at the line tonight, and he sinks it. Smith has a total of six points. It's a 16-point lead, 60 to 44. He misses the second, and Zach Kelly gets the rebound. And it's going to be called on, I believe, number 55. And I believe that's going to be his fourth foul. So at the line for Northview is number 34, Zach Kelly. He's perfect from the line. He's 5 of 5. And he misses his first one, but he's been excellent from the line. He's 5 of 6. Nice spin move that time by Johnson. And that ball is just taken away. And Gibson goes up and slams it through for two more. 12 points for Gibson. Northview up 52, 62 to 46. Smith for three. It's missed. And uh, Johnson goes up with it. And he's fouled uh, by Joe Coachman. 
So he's going to be shooting two. He's four and five from the line. 22 points tonight for Johnson. Make it 23. He's having a big night. That was short. And it goes out of bounds off of Northview. Northview up by 15 points. We still have a lot of time left in this game. Four minutes, three seconds. And Zach Kelly goes up high. And Joe Coachman slams it through. Coachman on the slam. Nice feed down to Johnson for two more. I tell you, Johnson's had an outstanding game tonight. So let's take a break with 343 left in the fourth. The score is Northview 64, Andalusia 49. Twenty five points. Northview was caught sleeping that time. They almost turned it over. Zach Kelly with it. And we're going to have a foul called on number five, D.L. Smith. So uh, the end of bonus. So Zach Kelly will be going to the line. He's five or six from the line. Make it six of seven. Sixteen points for Kelly. Two more. One more for Kelly. North York by 17, 66 to 49. Three minutes, 26 seconds left. Goes to Johnson, and that time, Gibson got him. And a layup by number three, James Ransom, for his first points of the game. And we're going to have a foul called on Ransom. No, they call it on number five, Coachman. At the line is uh, Johnson, who has 25 points in the game. He's had a big game tonight. It's another free throw. Make it 26 points. He's leading the all scores. 27 points. Northview up by 17, 68 to 51. Three minutes left in the game. Zach Kelly, he steps on the line, so the Cougars turn it over to the Bulldogs. Smith brings it up, and they're going to try to get it into number 55, Johnson. He's been very effective tonight. And what they got to do is deny him the ball. They're allowing them to pass the ball into Johnson. But I guess at this point in the game, it really doesn't matter that much. But you still need to, to deny him the ball. Johnson, he's been really good from the foul line.
He's 9 of 11 from the foul line. And a reverse slam. Nice feed that time from Biggums over to Gibson. 70 to 53. Shot from the corner. No good. Rebounded by Coachman. That's what I'm talking about. Nice backward slam from Gibson. Over to Gibson in the corner. He kicks it back out to Biggums. Ransom with the ball. A minute 50. Ramson drives. Oh, he tries to get it to Gibson. It was just a little too high. Johnson gets the rebound. And it's blocked by Zach Kelly. At the time, uh, Johnson was trying to take it in, and it was blocked. Kerry takes it out. And Ramson with the steal. And he lays it up and in for two. James Ransom has come in and made a couple of big plays for the Cougars. They're up by 1972 to 53. Smith goes in. Miss. Rebound goes to Kelly. Kelly out to Coachman. Ramson kicks it back to Coachman. A minute 10 left. They get it to Biggums. He spins. He turns. And it's going to be out of bounds off of uh, Andalusia. So the Cougars will maintain possession. One oh three left. Seventy two to fifty three. Kelly gets it to Ranson. They'll probably just try to run the clock out. Forty seven seconds. Zach Kelly. Kelly takes it, gets it to Gibson, and he goes up, and he's fouled. So Gibson's going to be at the line shooting two. 14 points for Gibson tonight. He's 4-4 from the line. Into the game for Andalusia, number 54, Jay Curry. Foul called on number 43. Okay, this 54 has got to come back out of the game. Hey, Gibson's at the line. He's shooting two. That was good. 15 points for Xavier Gibson. His team is up by 20 points, 73 to 53. Second one up. Gibson's perfect from the line tonight. Six of six. Andalusia calls a timeout with uh, 34.8 seconds left, and it's the Cougars' biggest lead of the game, uh, 21 points, 74 to 53. Just kind of recapping the scoring by quarters at the end of one. Northview led 17 to 10 halftime. They led 36 to 23 at the end of three. The Cougars were on top by 15 points. 50 to 35, and now they are leading by 21, that biggest lead of the game, 74 to 53. And it's, it's been a, a well-balanced game for the Cougars. They've, uh, the starters all have really showed up tonight, and uh, it's been a, a balanced scoring attack. 
Now, if you look on the Andalusia side, it's been a one-man show, and that's number 55, Johnson, has had an outstanding game. He goes up and shoots, and we're going to have a foul called on number three, James Ransom. Both teams are in the bonus. At the line is number 31, Dennison. He's scoreless tonight. First time at the line. Second one up, and it's good. So Dennison hits one of two. 20 seconds left. Ransom brings it down. They're going to just try to run the clock out. Ransom does a little shake and bang, lays it up, and it rolls out. Curry gets it. And that time, Johnson thought he was going to get a, another basket, but uh, there to hit it was uh, knocking away was uh, Joe Coachman. And so it's a foul on Coachman. That's the 30th point for Johnson. Make it 31 points for Johnson. So that's going to end the game. Northview wins it 74 to 56. A big win for the Cougars, their last home game, regular season home game of the year. We're going to take a break and we'll be right back with the wrap up of tonight's game. 